Hey guys, what is going on? Stargazer 1331 back once again, bringing you some more Mugen. What do we got? What the hell do we got today? All right, we got uh, we got the 1840s. That's what we got. So I already rolled before I started recording, so I already got that all planned at least. So, uh, all right, random Mugen battle number 1840, and as usual for like the last god, I think like 10 episodes or something like that. Yeah, you guessed it. We are starting off with the turns battle. So. Let's see. I've been thinking. Well, then of course you would appear. Oh man, I think I, I think this really is gonna be become gonna becomes um the main. I don't know if it's an attraction or a detraction of this of my series. Is that the worst? I think I honestly would have to say my roster produces some of the worst battles in all of Mugen history. I mean, not all the time, but I'd say well over, like, 70% of the time. It's to the, it's to the point now where it, it's, it's become almost laughable. Jesus Christ, man. Wow. Kuo's doing really, really solid as well. See if Condor can can finish him off. Oh my God! Okay. Oh, Condor officially laid down the gauntlet. Now let's see. Now, no, now what? No, what I was getting to. Oh sweet Jesus, dude. He's dead. Wow. As I was saying before, Kachira just completely just owned all. Um, I actually think I really, really want to get back into doing just the regular marathons, and because of that. I'm actually thinking of ending of, of, of ending this after 1900 instead of 2000, just because I really I really miss doing marathons in that format. And again, just to clarify, I'm not ending uh, I'm not ending. Well, what am I trying to say? Like, I'm not stopping Mugen. No, 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 no. It's just that this series has kind of run on long enough because this is the or technically the original series that I've done ever since I started. However, though. However, though, that's going to change once I bring back the marathons, which I have not done one since, god, like 2015? So it's it's been over a year now since I've done a marathon, and I prefer doing them overall because it's a little more of a free, it's a little more of a freer format. Like, there's, like, this clearly has structure to it, even in the descriptions, as you can tell, and just by the way, I always list each battle off as this. The marathons, not quite, it's not going to quite be that way. I mean, even they had a little bit of structure, but I'm, I'm going to be changing that a little bit. And I might even make the videos an hour long as well, so if you're into the longer videos, then then great. I don't know, I'll, I'll, I'll see, I'll try it and see what you guys think of that, but as of now... But as of now, yeah, I think 1900 is going to be it, just because... Another thing I need to address is that doing the descriptions for these videos, it is so dreadful. I hate doing those kind of descriptions. Like, oh god, they just seem so manufactured, it's just like, oh my god, like, it's just, like, you think I'm, like, cranking this out of, like, an assembly line or something like that, it's just, it, oh god, it's just, I just, I just don't like doing them like that anymore, I really don't, because I remember, I think it was in the, I think it might have been in the 10th marathon, actually, and I think I did it in one of my tournaments, where I had the description be kind of on more on the subtle side, you know, I, I kind of list off maybe an event that happened in a battle that kind of would m make you have... I know, that could probably make you guess what the battle is like, but of course you won't know for sure unless you actually see it. So, you know, yeah, something along those lines, but as you can see, that turns battle was complete garbage. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh yes! Yep, my roster at work, people. My roster at work. Okay, let's see. Random Booger Battle number 1841. Uh, let's see. Um, hmm. Let's do... Yeah, let's do a 3v3 fight. Yeah, after that, turns of battle, just no... No way. Ooh, Ghost Rider. I like that. I, I, I like him quite a bit, actually. Really? Really Apollo EX? 
or Paul, yeah, Paul Luiex. All right, so you got Keo, No Vermillion, and Ghost Rider against Lucky Globber, Dark Magician Girl, and Apollo EX. Have fun! Oh my god. Ghost Rider, ah oh man, you're, you're, you're killing everybody's headphones. What the hell? Woo! Oh jeez. Oh my god. This is this is the Nova really that can do a crap ton of damage if given the right hyper, but no, she just gets overwhelmed in the corner big time by Lucky Glover's basketballs in Apollo. Come on! Get round three, please, please for me. Oh my god. Oh my god, Ghost Rider's going crazy with the motorcycle. Oh my god, Black Magician Girl's down. She, oh, she's gone, son. Oh man, it's all down to Mr. Glover. You're dead. Wow, man. Holy hell, man. Yeah, apparently you missed uh, Globber, Black Magician Girl, and Apollo EX getting arrested. Other than that, though, no, yeah, you didn't really miss anything. Other than that key little detail, no, yeah, you didn't miss a damn thing. Oh, jeez, they're pissed. They're pissed. Oh, my goodness. Ghost Rider's going for it again. Ooh! Oh yeah, yeah, they're gone. They're toast. They're done. Oh man, nice try. Nice try, you guys. I had a hunch as soon as I saw Black Magician go in in um you know in tandem with Globber. Oh man, it looked it looked iffy on that one. But give I'll give credit where credit's due. Ghost Rider's team took a round off them. They came close in the final round. Boom! There you go. Let's see. Uh, what do we got? Ryan Boogie Bell number 1842. Yeah, let's see, let's do uh, let's do another one. Why not? Yep, that's the 3v3 for you guys. Uh, what do we got? Oh, joy of all joys. I think that oh god, I forgot who that was. You'll see it in the description. That's kind of the other thing that might make it a little more of a mystery element, which I might have to just address in the comments section. Is because the descriptions aren't gonna have the character names in it anymore. Um, you know, the, the, this is starting, this is with the marathons. I might have to just address them in the comments section, meaning, like, any characters I missed, I'll just make a comment on it in the comment section, and then I'll just say, you know, it was this character, blah, 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 and all that. Hey, we got Kung Fu Fune, at least. Right. Ooh, Kung Fu Fune, new Kratos and Harui. Yeah, I think, I think left side's gonna just trash him. I don't know, man, this is, this is a cheap character. Yep. Yeah, TK, if you're watching this, I'm sorry. Yeah, just, oh my god. <laughs> you see what I mean when I say worst battles in Mugen history? This is what I'm talking about. <laughs> Wow. Man, just freaking just completely, completely trounced in that battle. Oh, God. <sighs> oh, man. Like, that was just, that was just a pure, that was just a pure thrashing. As soon as I saw that third character, which I think is a Renzi character, mind you, it's just like, yeah, it's all over. It is all over. But, hey, that's what happens. 
a part of it, I think, too, is the right. The random select in this game is just. I don't know. I don't know if it's really fair to judge that per se, but my god, is it? It does not pick well, most of the time. All right. At any rate, though, let's see. All right. We're gonna go to number eighteen forty-three. Let's um, let's bump it on up again to a four v four simul. Yay, this, this is this is Black Man uh, 1467's favorite kind of battle, and by that, and by that I'm being very sarcastic, he hates these kind, which is fair. Because the, the problem when it comes to 3v3 and 4v4, as crazy, as fun as it is to watch them sometimes, I'll, I'll admit this, half the time you don't know what the heck is even happening in these matches. I mean, for me at least that's part of the fun, but for some people it could just be like, it's like, like what the hell am I even watching? Wow. Man, not not even not even the mighty cat can do anything, and freaking Lucky Glover's back again with an OP as hell team. Like like why why are you favoring him all of a sudden? Cat is pissed! Holy hell, cat! R really? He freaking. S <laughs> wow. Man. Oh, for, well, for those that hate cat with all, all passion, will have loved this match. But man, that was another quickie right there. Jeez. Man, it's already time to ro roll the dice again. <laughs> wow, okay. Nice. Nice selection dice, like, r really, really good. Yeah, let's see. Alright, random moving battle number 1844. Let's, um, let's go back to a turns fight. Oh, wow. Yep, no, no, another cheaper Renzi header. I believe that that is Yuhei, I think, if I remember correctly. <gasps> Please be old school 10 star. Please be old school 10 star. Wow. Friggin' 10 star and rise star, okay. I hope he finishes with, with, with a very with a very particular hyper. Because of Rystar, this is one move that I've only seen Rystar do it once. Ooh, he might do it. Oh, how, how did he miss him? Oh, he killed him anyway. Oh, so you get Rystar versus Rayman. You missed. We we quit missing that rise star. Like Rayman, hello. Of course, of course, Raven has the ability to fly. That missed as well, rise star. I can definitely cover a lot of ground. And he won again. Good luck against Sailor Saturn, though. You're gonna need it. <laughs> oh, jeez.
And you're dead. Hyper overkill finish. By means of the stab attack. Show you in. And you are dead again. The reason I say again is because Xiao Yan hasn't really done that well in this roster. Ooh, we got GM's Ryu, okay. Oh, yeah. Nice. Oh my god, that stab attack is just is so beast. Oh, that almost killed- Oh! Ooh, man, way to juggle her, Ryu. Wow, I'll give you props to that one. Oh, my God. Oh, yep, you hey. Oh, boy. Oh, wow, yeah, nice grab. Man, nice dodging the arrow and everything, man. Jesus Christmas, dude. This character is freaking crazy. Boom! Holy hell! Nice job, GM's Ryu! Oh, and man, and this is one reason I don't want to change this roster out necessarily. Because you can, you can get this. You get this kind of stuff. The guys of War never stray from, from, the, from the spectacle of battle. Man, actually this battle was a spectacle, honestly. That, oh man. That was a nice stroke of genius by that Ryu, I gotta say. Yeah, let's see. Alright, so... What do we have? Yep, so that was the first one. Okay. Okay, random book amount number 1845. Let's, um... Let's see. Okay, good. Alright, let's, um... Yeah, let's go back to a 4v4. Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna be seeing a couple more of those. I guarantee it. Ooh, aggressor Johnny Cage. I... Those of you that might be newer, you're wondering... Why, why, why am I calling him aggressor Johnny Cage? It's because he's one of the Mortal Kombat characters that has the aggressor meter, which I forgot. I thought that that was from Ultimate Marvel. Um, Ultimate Marvel's character. Ultimate, you know, the was the Ultimate Mortal Kombat trilogy. Y you know, U UMK, UMK three, I should say. Oh, nice! We got Shanghai. Oh my Jesus! What is even happening? All I'm seeing is just like, all I'm seeing is just mass carnage and rainbows. Really, Alex Mercer? Wow. Sur man, I'm surprised that match was- yeah, for, of course, freaking Alex Mercer had to glitch out. Like, I don't even know what the hell even happened to him, either. Oh my god, Dawson. That's it. Wow. Man, that boy, that was that was all over the damn place in that one, but man. Of course. Of course freaking Rayquaza wins that one, because Rayquaza almost always wins. Yeah, let's see. Alright, Render Book about number 1846. Yeah, very good. Let's see. Yep, let's do yet another one. Yep. 
Ooh, freaking Michelangelo. All right. It's not a bad. <laughs> oh my goodness. Ronald McFreaking Donald. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Don't for tries. Oh, that's the older version. Is the, the one that where time stopping technique doesn't really work that well. Ta da! So, freaking Julie Scallopy, DJ, and Ronald McDonald. Wow. Oh god, oh no. Oh jeez. Oh no. Right here, right here. Oh my god, what a team. Oh my god, Ronald McDonald. Just wow. <laughs> oh my goodness. Alright, right away we're about our 1847. Yep. Yep, we got it. Yep, you got it. Another 4v4 match. Oh man. Really? Now I got an edit of Julie. So I think it is. Yeah, I think it is an edit of Julie. <gasps> if it is Deadpool! Alright. Oh, he's with Neo Sonic and Cyclops, I think. And also Keon, I think. Or is it Robocop? Yeah, yeah, it's Keon. What? What? Surprised Aya was doing that badly. Wow, that's it. Jeez. I did it! Fantastic! <laughs> oh man, I I, I know Neo Sonic kind of kind of makes me cringe sometimes, but I don't know, man. I got I gotta give it a freaking Deadpool, Deadpool and Cyclops, man. That's 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 it. That's that's I'm surprised, surprised, surprised that freaking Aya isn't isn't getting in on this more often. There there she goes. Oh! Oh my goodness! I mean, freaking Robocop's still alive too. Oh, ho oh, ho, man, that was a closer round, that one. Oh man, good. All right. Well, I'll give the I'll give the left side some credit. They definitely tried in that one at least. So eh, actually, not too bad. I mean, I wish it went in round that. Actually, would have been really sweet if that went in round three. But it's, yeah, it's good enough there. All right. And so, ready to move about number eighteen forty-eight. It's um yeah. Yep. Got yet another one. So let's do it. Why not? Yeah. This is a four v four. Um. Yeah. No. Uh, yeah. No singles or doubles. It's been freaking four v four triples and turns. That's it. And we got Curse Seal, which he's one of the cheaper characters that Meatwise has given me that I that I actually kind of like. Something about this guy, I don't know, man. He's just he's a freaking badass. That's all he is. You know, if the game crashes, I'm I'm honestly not gonna be surprised because man, I there's a lot of shit happening right now. <laughs> And this is surprisingly close right now. 
Well, Saber just really hasn't taken that much health, though. Oh my god, Roa is making the comeback of a lifetime. What in the name of crap? Oh, what? Holy hell, that was close. Man, I, th I I think I don't know about Curse Hill, but I, I think the other two were almost down to their um, last legs. Jeez. Yeah, you, you don't you don't mess with Curse Seal. His power as OP as his character is, I kinda I don't know, man. I kinda like him in some way. But there you go. And Nightwolf with a very, very, very not clearly not made for this screen pack type of portrait. Oh jeez. Alright, well, and lastly, random book about number eighteen forty nine. Let's, um, alright, well, we start off with one, let's end it off with the turns battle. Alright. Ooh, yeah, we, we got this to get, which I thought was, I forgot if Dark Luigi edit this one or not. Chili and Pepper, man, I haven't seen Chili and Pepper in a while. Trunks versus the Noi, this much actually should be pretty okay. Are you- Wow, I think we have all normal characters in this, although that might be Omega Dink Small one after the Noid. I'm kinda hoping that that's regular- Actually, no, you know what? Actually, no, I actually wanted to be Omega Dink Small one now. Nice job, Noid. Can he can he do it against Hercule? I'll give him a lot of credit if he can beat her if he can beat the upgraded Hercule. Yeah, he missed. Yeah, that's about what I figured. Nice, nice shot, Hercule. Will you get embarrassed? Get yeah, uh, oh, okay, no, it is, it is regular. Oh, thank God. <laughs> Actually, I'll be honest, I kind of... That would have been just plain bad if that was, if that was um, Omega. <laughs> it's funny, he can toss bombs and so, and so, so can't, um, so can't dink. Oh god. Not oh, freaking present for you. Oh no, dang! Oh heck man. You will die, mortal. Think Small just barely nabbing that that win right there. Now it's out of Subaki. I think I I think Subaki might win this. It's a strong bet that she might not win this now.
Well, okay. That was a that was a hard performance. Nope, he's dead. You are dead. Not the big surprise. Oh, yeah. yeah, that's it. Fatality. Uh, and, that, and, that, and that will about conclude this episode. Hope you enjoyed it, guys. Yeah, this one was... I think this one was a little better than the last one, so... And again, as soon as I... Now, as soon as I say that this series is going to end, now the game's going to be giving me good battles. But not, not to worry. Let me just clarify again for those that... For those that are a little confused, yeah, I'm not going to be ending. The, I'm I'm not going to be um, ending my moving series as a whole. No way, no far, no, 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 no. It's just that this this particular series that I'm doing now, I'm going to be I'm going to be ending this and going to doing the Mugen marathons instead because I I prefer doing the Mugen marathons a little better or a little more than this because what it was, I didn't think I was going to be doing the marathons again, which is why I continued this. But I'm like, yeah, I'm just it's like I still got the marathons. They're just they're just kind of do it standing there in my in my video list just doing nothing. So I'm like, yeah, you know what? This one's been going on long enough. I think it's about time I'll just stick to marathons. But at any rate, I'll get into more details when the marathons actually happen. But yeah, in about another month's time, yeah, it'll it'll be I'll be up to nineteen hundred, so then that'll be the last one. But until next time, guys, I will uh I will see you later there.